About a year ago, I realized that, that I loved Jesus, but I didn't necessarily love the church. Now I say church, obviously, we're kind of using that word uh, kind of uh, differently, I guess, these days. I personally, even now, even when I use the word, I got to go, what is church? It was a, a place you went to. Uh, it was a it was somewhat community. I didn't sense a responsibility to the body. I, I really sensed a responsibility in my relationship with Jesus and my family. The body, uh, you know, I just didn't, it wasn't on my radar. You know, as we went through the, the Gospel of John this past year, um, it was like Jesus was speaking to me. It caught me off guard, and I knew that uh, I, my thinking had to change, my heart had to change, and it slowly started to change. But then one day, one, one Wednesday morning, I'm meeting with the guys, and it was like, I, I don't know you guys. And, and primarily because I don't know your wives, I don't know your kids. And so that was my challenge I gave to them, that we really gotta go deeper. You know, and sometimes we were going through a, uh, maybe a Bible study, but over time, it's become more of an opportunity to share, uh, encourage people to, to, to offer a word from, from Scripture, uh, how God has, has, has spoke to them this week through Scripture. Um, we will do communion uh, on occasion. Uh, we will love on each other. We'll pray with each other. We'll, we'll get into each other's lives and say, hey, where, where can we help? Where, where can we come alongside you? I think so often we're, we're planning on, okay, we're going to have this event and these are the results. I'm less and less uh, worried about what happens as opposed to creating space for people to connect. It's people who love God, who realize that, uh, that they are, are broken apart from God, uh, that, that they're okay with, with sharing their hurts, their pains, people that are willing to, to take off the mask and, and be honest and real. I think that's what attracts people to, to, to Jesus. The church to me was this place I went to on Sunday or Saturday night or, or Monday, whatever. It was a place. Now church to me is family. If you're that guy, I mean, you've been faithful to the, the church. I mean, you're involved, you're engaged, you're doing all these things. But uh, when you're in deep weeds, when, you, when, you're, when you're doubting if this is real, um, who are you gonna go to? Do you have two or three guys that you can go to because you built a relationship with, that they know your story and they can speak into your story and encourage you. That's what I see the distributed church is all about.